the morning. Wright Venture is a Shark Tank inspired student business plan competition where students of any major at Wright State University compete for a chance to win up to $5,000 in business startup funding. Denaric Black is the head of the program and I'm also joined by last year's winner, Adam Wick. So Denaric, I want to start with you first because I want to get some of the nuts and bolts of what this program really is. We kind of laid it out there, but what exactly inspired this program? Obviously Shark Tank is a very popular uh, show out there, but what made you want to do it at Wright State? Well, this is the third year of the program. It was inspired uh, because of the support that our Rod Swan College of Business gives to entrepreneurship. Uh, it was a partnership between them and the Small <clears throat> Business Development Center, which is the center that I uh, direct, mm -hmm. which provides um, small business counseling and workshops to uh, small businesses throughout the region. So we thought it would be great to bring all that knowledge and give the kids an opportunity to uh, put business plans together and then uh, fund, give them some seed money to yeah. fund their project. I imagine the, the response to this was there was welcome with some excitement too. What, what is the response initially, and how has this kind of grown over the years? Well, it's 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 grown pretty good over the last twelve over the last three years. This year we had twelve participants, and we also held workshops where we got different business leaders throughout the community to come in and talk about the different aspects of starting a business, uh, some of the key elements that you would need to be able to do a good business plan. Um, do uh, put together good financial projections and then how to pitch your business to funders. Right, and so pitching the business is obviously important too. And uh, clearly, Adam, you were successful in your pitch. <laughs> what do you have in front of us? Because you were last year's winner of this program. What do you have in front of us? Uh, what was your What was your pitch? Right, right. So actually, my, my product <clears throat> was really a, start off as a card game that I was doodling back when I was like a ten year old kid. <laughs> back when I couldn't afford to keep up with Pokemon and all the popular games. I still there. can't keep up with Pokemon. But you know, it, it's actually crazy. People ask me, well, why are you pitching a, a tabletop battle card game instead of like a video game and stuff like that? I mm. mean, first, there are certain strategic advantages. It's, it's low cost, easy market to get into. But it's actually kind of a market in a renaissance right now. You know, a lot of the younger generation that grew up on video games, yeah. this is all new territory for them. Yeah. And it's very exciting to sit down and play a game face to face with people. Right. Well, that's something in this day and age, too, that we hear so much. The knock of technology is that people are just buried in their phones as opposed to doing something that's really personally interactive. So this is called Galatune. And um, tell us a little bit about how it works then. Right. So if, if someone plays video games or they've never played a tabletop game like this before, it's pretty easy to jump into. But uh, basic gist of it is kind of like a crazy free-for-all battle arena where two to five people all sit in a circle, you each <clears throat> control a different warrior, and you're just in it, uh, you're all taking your turns at the same time so you don't have to wait on each other, and just fighting it out to see who gets the most points. All right, and so obviously you won the competition last year, which gave you the funding to kind of start everything. How has the last year been now that you, you got that funding as a result um, it, of this? It's been a whirlwind. Be the funding was great because it gave us what we needed to get a proof of concept together, hire an artist. But beyond that, the biggest value of the competition has definitely been all the great uh, mentors and networking opportunities, uh, all these great leaders in the local community helping to connect with the right resources. And after we got our proof of concept together, we were able to successfully launch a Kickstarter, mm -hmm. which got us the rest of the fund that we needed. And I'm happy to say we're in full production right now, to, uh, taking pre-orders on Galatune.com and expect to hit the shelves this April. And so I imagine this is uh, very uh, fulfilling for you to see uh, this come to fruition. It, it really is. Uh, Adam was the, the, the perfect reason why we did this program. He was a student. He had an idea. He was able to tap into some of the local resources and some of the expertise that, that, my, um, that my center and other uh, centers throughout the community bring. And he was able to you know, bring his dream alive. Well, it's a, it sounds like a great program, and, it's, and it's, it'll be exciting to see in years to come, including this year, who will be the future winners and what will come of it, too. So, Daneric, uh, thank you so much for coming in, and uh, we appreciate Adam and you as well. And congratulations uh, on winning, and, and good luck with your business going forward. For a list of business workshops uh, or counseling, you can visit www.sbdcwsu.com, or you can call our call center at 937-775-47671. Thanks so much for uh, coming in this morning. Of course, today is also Groundhog Day, so we're taking a look live at Punk's